I'm gonna start playing this goddamn game again. Knock, knock, police! Hello? Police! I'm gonna knock on that door. Police. Hello? Hello, it's the police. Yeah, we got a noise complaint. Can we talk to you real quick, please? Is that Greg? Is that Greg? Yes, sir. Okay, it's Oscar Jones. Okay. Who's in the house, Greg? Uh, Paul should be there. And my cousin, uh, that's it. Okay. You don't have anything in your hands? No, sir. Okay. You don't have any guns or anything on no, you? No, sir. Okay. Come out here to my car. Who's, Greg, who's that? Just, Nobody should have been out here with a gun. Well, there's two complaints. One said that somebody's out here playing a guitar with an amplifier. Well, you know I got guitars, but I ain't got nothing hooked up. No amplifier. Mm -hmm. And then we were also told that somebody's out here waving a gun. Okay. I know it's cold, but I don't know what you oh. have in your pockets, but Okay. Sorry. Um, you don't have anything around your waist? No. Nope. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna check because someone says there was a gun. Not a problem, brother. Okay. Only thing I have is a knife in my left pocket. Okay. Well, as long as it stays in your left pocket, I'm good. Okay. Paula, um, um, I think uh, um, this is a C. The first Paula is um, Alright. Here last night. here the other night with uh Sarah. With Sarah. Okay. She drives uh She lives Port Exploder. Yeah. Where does where does she live? Over there on Um she's right now she's got her uh, trailer down at the uh the Parker uh, uh, uh KOA. Yeah, she was down there and now she had problems with her septic so she took it down here to uh the Whose dog is this? That uh, that would be uh, uh, Paula's friend. Um, the dude I'm trying to take his name. She's trying to like him. I just married him today. Um, where is his name? Where's that little kid out there? Um, Oli. Oh. Oli. Like Oli's beard. Oh, okay. So you're playing guitar, but no amplifier, no? No, I did, and I haven't played my guitar in a couple days. Who's playing it tonight? Well, um, my kid quarter neighbor, he plays the guitar quite often. Um, well, it was tonight. Donnie, also. Donnie, across the street. Over on the corner? Yeah, sometimes he plays too. But as far as anybody having a gun around here, nobody should have a gun around here. Nobody's out here screaming, yelling, no. cussing, anything no. like that? Okay, here's the deal. No more noise. Not a problem, sir. 
It's one o'clock in the friggin' morning. You got neighbors that want to sleep. Okay. I, 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 we come back. Someone's gonna probably get cited for a noise violation. Okay. Yes, sir. So we'll leave it up to you, Greg. Just make sure I'll that please you it. The P's and Q's. I will please it myself. Okay. And what is your status as far as getting out of here? Um, I talked to the landlord the other day, and once again today, and um, um, we should. Uh, I had to go rent two storage units, plus be able to be able to have the money to move all the way out to Deer Park. Yeah. It's it's it's. Do you have it's any? Really do you have any warrants right now? No. Nope. You nope. don't. Absolutely nope. not. Absolutely not. Are you absolutely sure? I'm absolutely positive. I just got out a couple days. What were you? Correct. That trailer that I had on you? Yeah. Well, apparently it was leased. <laughs> I had a loan on it. Oh. So my husband had to go uh, to jail for it. Um, it's been about. That little utility trailer? Yeah. Out here? I, I even showed him the bill of sale and everything. And, and uh, they still ran my ass in. And I showed it to, to the judge the very next morning. And so what did it come out? Stolen or something? No, it's, it, it belongs to a title agency. Well, at first it wasn't coming back a, underneath the title uh, a title issue. Uh, it was just coming back as as a leased uh, item that had not been returned, and so um, it came back as, uh, once after. Uh, of course, I get it into the detention and into the holding, and they come up and cite me the next morning and said, well, our bad. Well, yeah, it's your bad. They said, I've got some bills still and everything right hey, here. Hey, Greg, right real quick, how do, you, how do you spell your last name? G-R-A-H-A-N. And um, so uh, they kicked me loose. What's your name. middle name? Raymond. 11 Code 4. What's your date of birth? 11 72. 11, 16, and 72. Yes, so where, where did you go? Uh, okay, wait, let's check one. No, what's the deal? Thursday, got out. Friday. Last of Graham, George, Robert, Adam, Henry, Adam, Mary. First of Greg or Gregory, middle R. 72, 11, 16. I believe he's out of Montana. He should be in Oregon. Oh, I'm definitely in Oregon. Yeah, you are. <laughs> I already went through that with her too. Yeah, oh, yeah. I forgot to tell you, I'm audio and video recording. Oh, not a problem. Um, yeah, January, all the way up to January. Okay. It's been over almost, oh, almost a year. Yeah, it's been a while. Yeah, yeah. They want her to come up with her own resolution. I thought you heard the deal. Uh, that's, that's what I took the alpha plea. Probably still coke for. And then I see Alfred with the, what they, they consider the Alfred. I don't know. An Alfred? Alfred, there you go. Yeah. Uh, I want to think of James Alfred from Judas Priest when they say that. But, but uh, I call it an Alfred. There's an, there, because there's, they got you like a dog, you know what I mean? Yeah, it's, there's it's, enough to convict you, but you're not a, admitting guilt. Right. Right. And I, I said, well, as long, because, you know, Sarah was just guilty of going down and getting her mom's car. That's basically all she was guilty of doing. And so that's the reason why she, I told her to take it straight to the box. She didn't do anything wrong. Yeah. You know what I mean? And so um, they they flat refused to get a jury trial about it. Um, they won't come. She won't take any of their deals. So last week or whatever, when they came up with this new court date, they said, well, what do you recommend? You know? So I should get, take it over. You know what I mean? So. Hey, cause I know when we talked to her and Paula, like, what, last week? She, yeah. you know, they were here and she didn't want to come out because she thought she had a warrant or ran her. Well, because her, recall the, yeah, her, her attorney, I, see, she had to go outside of the public defender's office because we, we were both inside the public defender's okay. office. And so I guess there was a conflict of interest there. Yeah. So they had to hire her an attorney outside of that. Outside of that. So um, he looks like a, I swear to God, he reminds me of KFC. Huh. Uh, that you know, Kentucky Fried Chicken dude. But he looks like a. But he's. Professor type too, you know, like um, um, Harry Potter stuff. You know, he's got the gray hair and the gray beard, but very, uh, very uh, worthy with his words. And as soon as my case was over, 
he wanted me to come on as a witness. I said, hey, man, I'm squashed. I don't care if she's my wife or not, man. I'm done with this shit. You know what I mean? He Makes said, well, he, says, uh, he says, well, uh, would you mind if I, like, if I had to subpoena you for a witness? I guess if you had to subpoena me for a witness, then you'd have yeah. to. But I said, as far as I'm concerned, I took the uh, Alfred plea. Yeah. You know, so she wouldn't have to go through any more of this so, yeah, you just deal with bullshit. It. So, anyway, he got the wrong paper, didn't get the paperwork filed in time for the new court date or whatever, and she thought maybe she was going to go Okay, we're going we're gonna to leave it over. Just I make sure they stay inside yeah. and they're not out not here. Problem. Make Keep sure the neighbors up. Make sure they understand no noise. Got it, sir. Okay. All right. That's it. All right. Appreciate it, Greg. Yep. Not Take a care. Too. Be careful around here. I don't know what's all laying around. It's all good. We got it. Thank you, though.